Watch out. And three, two, one, pop. <laughs> Pretty cool, right? You can try it too Duck! if you. aren't you? That is one seriously cool temple. Yeah, points for Ivor, I guess. This was a good tip. Well, Jesse? So, are we doing this? I think Jesse's just taking it all in. Order of the Stone, it's time to get some glory. For, for glory! glory! for treasure. Come on, you know how these places work. The treasure's never just out in the open. Let's fan out and search the place. Petra. Who's Petra? <laughs> Kidding. So, how are you feeling lately? Memory's all back, as far as I can tell. Now I'm just trying to get used to having teammates and people who worry about me. That's pretty new for me. It's nice, though. Thoughts on this place? I think I'd rather be in a straight fight than doing all this switch pulling stuff. But I'm glad Ivor's intel about this place was good. Okay, I'm gonna keep trying to solve this. Does me no good. Hey, Olivia. Yeah. Any ideas for how to fix this? Well, these channels of lava are blocked in strategic locations by those sticky pistons. Unblock them. And I'm guessing something cool will happen. So what kind of treasure do you hope we find in here? Well, I've been working on a build that could use another couple dispensers. But some cocoa beans would be cool too. Okay, I'm gonna figure this out. Never doubted you for a minute. It's not. Never mind. Locked again.
been disappointed if the floor didn't open up into a dark, creepy passageway. This kind of reminds me of when we first found the Order's Temple. We were such a scared bunch of noobs back then. Hey, I wasn't scared. Wow, yeah, that feels like it was, I don't know, a million years ago. Packed a lot in since then. And to think, that was just the beginning. Yeah, and that was before we'd fought wither storms, hung out with Enderman, reunited the Order. So crazy. enchantment on flint and steel before but that's not unbreaking you could give it a shot and find out okay flint and steel do your thing well i have definitely never seen flint and steel do that before you out of here 
I tell you guys, doing that never gets old. Woo! Yeah, not too bad. Killing a bunch of monsters, getting sweet treasure. Like that flint and steel thing? You gotta try it again. I'd be curious to see it again, too. I'm dying to know how it works. I'm good. You can give it a shot, though. <laughs> whoa, whoa. Well, well. Where'd you get the new toy? Order of the losers. Yeah, losers. Ugh, who let you guys out of your cave? Joke's on you, we don't live in a cave. Ugh, what grief are you here to give us now? Look who's talking. So what are you ocelots doing here anyway? The ocelots were Lucas's gang. We ditched that name just like we ditched him. Yeah, we rebranded. We're the Blaze Rods now. Blaze Rods! Shut up, Gil. Sorry, boss. Huh. Pretty cool name. Of course it is. And I don't give a crap about what you think. And where's Lucas, huh? The minute the Order decided you were cool... For whatever reason... He wouldn't stop sniffing around you like a tame dog. You take that back! Hmm... No. Hey, Lucas is ten times the guy you are. Jeez, what is up with you creeps? I can't believe Lucas wanted to risk his neck to go save you guys. You probably think that thing makes you so special. Classic Jesse. You take all the best stuff and never give anyone else a chance. That should have been ours. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Blaze Rods. Hey, we earned this, all right? Fair and square. Yeah, we fought monsters, lava, and levers to get this thing, and we ain't giving it up. Nothing you've ever done has been fair and square, Jesse. Hand over the flint and steel, Jesse. Don't make me ask again. You don't get that one. It's supposed to be mine. Haven't you taken enough? Go find your own stuff, Aiden. It's not enough that you gotta save the world. You had to go and take all the world's best stuff, too. So, if I want my own stuff, that means I need to take it from you. I'm tired of listening to your jaw flap. Ah! Ugh. You don't touch me! <gasps> Some hero you are, Jesse. Let's just go home, you guys. These blaze rods aren't worth it. What hope do we have when heroes like you are throwing your weight around like this? It's not always going to be this way, though. Come on, you guys. Let's get out of here. Blaze Rods! Ooh. I told you to shut up! Look out, Jesse. I don't remember him being that angry before. Wow, they scared easy, didn't they? Not easy enough for my taste. We should be careful. He seems different. Scarier. Man, and all because he wanted that flint and steel. What are you gonna do with it? Ivor's the one that told us about this temple. He might know something about it. Hopefully Ivor can tell us more about it. Finally starting to recognize stuff again. Feels good to almost be home. Cheers to that, friend. I just can't shake what Aiden was saying about us back there. We do get a lot of treasure. And I guess sometimes we might throw our weight around. What? No. 
Aiden's got a bad case of treasure envy, pure and simple. I don't know. Come on, Aiden's just jealous, isn't that obvious? He sees us with our fancy armor, cool treasure, and he wishes he had it too. I guess so. Well, no matter what Aiden thinks, there's one thing I know. What's that? They think we're awesome. They're back! You guys, they're back! Run! Tell everyone that our heroes have returned! <laughs> yep, yeah. New Order of the Stone is back in town. to evoke skulls and tentacles. Oh, that thing looks completely dangerous. Eh, not my fault! Look out! Oh, uh, help! Oh, stop your whining! What are your pathetic injuries in comparison to my majestic tower? Ivor? <sighs> of course. Oh, Jesse, you're back! Don't listen to a word these fools tell you! It's a fire hazard! And your face is ugly hazard so i suppose we're even so what's this weird structure it's my new house and also uh my gift to the community if anyone's short on lava this is the place to get more <laughs> you're welcome jesse all i wanted was what any man wants a little house of my own with loads of lava pouring off it Ivor, I know you mean well, but your house wants to kill people. Dude, you made a killer house. Exactly! Killer! Shut up! What about just moving it someplace else? I'm sure- Move it? Way more lava is going to spill out if we do that. Well, we have to tear it down. We can't let that monstrosity stand. <laughs> It's my house, Jesse. I have just as much a right to build something as all these people, don't I? They're just jealous that I've got vision. Well, they've got, they've got... I'm sorry, Ivor, but your house is way too much of a hazard to the community. Tear it down, everyone. Good call. Ah, it's a slippery slope, Jesse. Today's a lava house, tomorrow, who knows what kind of rules you'll be imposing. Don't be a sore loser, Ivor. <laughs> Haven't seen you around in a while. So what can I do for you? Ivor, we found something in that temple you told us about. What? You did? <laughs> yes, great to see you again. Let's do lunch. I'll bring the carrots. There's no telling who's listening. Meet me in the treasure room. Ten minutes. And bring the thing you found. Well, if we're gonna tear this down, we better start getting some buckets together to scoop up all the lava. You got any iron? Oh man, no. I'm all out. <sighs> okay. We better go mine some more. We'll catch up with you later. Yeah, once we give this majestic house the funeral it deserves. Nice work today, guys. Yeah, not bad, right? Mm, it's like we should do this more often or something. Later, guys! Come on, let's go find Ivor. This is really shaping up. Whoa! Lucas! I don't believe it! 
Whoa, hey guys. You have some pretty cool stuff in here. Crazy stuff. Hey, Lucas, great to see you. It's been a while. I really missed you guys. Well, we missed you too. We have so many other treasures. Boy, you've sure been busy. Oh, wow. You framed it. I'm him. Yeah. How are you doing? Well, I haven't thought about him since it happened. It's easier that way. Gotcha. Well, if that's working, then that's good. <sighs> okay, guys. I promise I wasn't just here to bum everybody out. I actually came back because I need to tell you something. It's about this weird run-in I had with Aiden. Ugh, oh, I hate that guy. Whatever you said or did, it really got to him. Uh-huh, yeah, we saw him too. The Order of the Stone and the Blaze Rods are just as friendly as ever. That's an understatement. He's just been so jealous of you and the rest of the Order ever since you saved the world from the Witherstorm. He's convinced that he was supposed to be a hero. Ever since he took over the Ocelot and the Blaze Rods, it just seems like he's gotten meaner. He's pushing Maya and Gil around. Yeah, when we saw him, he kind of freaked me out. You know, making crazy threats, knocking his own gang around. So what'd you find that got Aiden so excited anyway? Check it out. Wow, what a weird glow. Yeah, I know. I'm supposed to show it to... You found it! Yeah! What? Dude, what's wrong with you? This is the greatest find of our time. I can't believe you're actually... That you're actually holding this. Okay, Spill, what's it do? It proves what I've always suspected. That glow, that enchantment, is the work of a very old group of builders. A group so old that they existed even before the Order of the Stone. Whoa. Yeah. Dramatic. Wow, I didn't know there was a time before the Order of the Stone. It's incredible, isn't it? I haven't even gotten to the best part. You see, if these builders truly existed, and if you found their temple, that means we're one step closer to finding the Eversource. What a beautiful sight. Looks like you came back just in time, Lucas. Did you just make that up? No! I found books! Mysterious tomes referencing it on my travels. Mysterious tomes, huh? The Eversource is said to be an object of incredible power possessed by the old builders. It was some sort of treasure or artifact that gave them an endless supply of precious materials. Think about it, Jesse. That temple must have been its hiding place! Wow! Old builders? You learn something new every day. I'm still just trying to wrap my head around the Eversource. Well, what are we waiting for then? We've already been to that temple once. Finding it again will be a snap. Old builders, Eversources, ancient mysteries. You know I'm in. Excellent! I'll pack my adventuring things immediately. Wait, he's coming? Wow, sounds like you guys have a lot to get to. I, uh, guess I'll take off? Nope, you're coming with. I need a buffer between me and Ivor. Let's get moving. This is so exciting. <laughs> Adventure! Lucas, I know it's daytime, but watch our backs, okay? I can't believe we're bringing Ivor with us. I mean, it's nice that he's so excited, but oh, not my top choice for adventuring companion. Oh, come on, he's super funny and he makes me laugh. I guess. These trees are enormous! I love it so much! He just really gets on my nerves sometimes. Remarkable. Look at this architecture. So old. So exquisite. Oh, this is just how I dreamed it would be. Ivor, it's nice to see you smiling. I'm not smiling. Wow, it looks so different during the day. Okay, but careful what you touch. There could be traps everywhere. Petra, blonde guy, are you two as excited as I am? 
I'm not sure that's possible. What? She means that you just seem to be super excited, Ivor. Barely got out of there last night. Doesn't look like it's opening up again anytime soon. That's all right. I had enough of the spiders and lava and everything that had to offer already. Look like those lava channels work anymore. I can't believe we missed some sort of secret area here last night. Uh, we were kind of fighting, oh, a ton of monsters. It's not surprising that we didn't hit every single nook and cranny. Excited, Ivor. Excited. I'm ecstatic. Thrilled. Overjoyed. The Eversource could finally be within my grasp. Once, sir. Uh, once we find it, that is. Well, that wasn't there last night. I'm heading up. Fantastic! We'll follow right behind you. Uh, yeah. What he said. So you think this Eversource thing is up here? Hard to say, Jesse. As the story goes, the old builders feared its potential. So they hid it away in a place where it would never be found. And ha! It never has been! What is Jesse doing up there? Well, that seems promising. Jesse, what do you see? <gasps> it's some kind of portal? It's just as I'd imagined. Spectacular. But where does it lead? I don't know. This portal it's not like anything I've ever seen. Here goes nothing. Oh, thanks for bringing this back to me, Jesse. I knew you were good for something. Dude, why are you being such a tool? Your little adventure is over, Jesse. Time to go home. Step aside, Jesse. We're heading through that portal now. Oh, no way! Aiden, you're done. This is where it ends. Fine. Blaze rods! Clear me a path. what trouble they'll cause. We're going after Aiden and we're going to take him down. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Uh, 
Heavy. I am uh, the proportionate weight for my height. Thank you very much. There you go. Easy now. Yes, thank you. Thank you. Okay, what just happened? How did that portal even work? I suppose much the same way a portal to the nether works, except to an entirely different world. See that? What? I'm starting to think Ivor was right about this being another world. I'm liking you better by the minute, Louie. If that island is a settlement or whatever, that's our best bet to find it. The city and the clouds. It almost sounds impossible. I just don't know how we're gonna reach it. Yeah, that's definitely gonna be a problem. I can't believe this. We fall through a portal into another world, and then we can't even go anywhere. Can't we just, like, build our way over? Uh, how? Oh, please! You've heard of a bridge, haven't you? I don't know. Seems like a long way. Do we have enough blocks? I mean, it's really, really far. Yes. Very astute, Lucas. I... Elementary, my dear Lucas. The underside of this island is much, much bigger than it appears. Really? Jesse's right. If we strip this whole island down to nothing, just be enough. Stop pushing! I'm not pushing! Lucas is pushing! I'm just trying to keep away from the edge! It's all edge! Okay, gang, I think that should do it. Let's make ourselves a bridge. Excellent! Okay, this is our stop. Everybody off. Ivor, seriously? This is in memory of my lava house. Long live lava! You're building. I, you, I, I, I don't. Hey there, I love what you did with your town. Yeah, it's very flashy. You help build it? You, 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 you were building. A unauthorized building is against the law. Wait. There's a law saying people can't build? Yes, it's forbidden. This, this makes no sense. No sense at I, all. I, 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 well, uh, that's the law? Okay, I'll bite. Why is building against the law? Oh, uh, this is making me terribly nervous, but, uh, first those other outsiders, now you. Other outsiders? Where are they? Uh, 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 they went to the inn. I I'm sorry, but that's all I know. Wait, 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 come back. You're super busy, sorry. And he's gone. <sighs> Darn. I wonder if everyone here is that... I'm nervous. <laughs> wow. Incredible. Wow, that is absolutely beautiful. Yes. Clearly, the Eversource is capable of miraculous things. And when I get my hands on it... Hey, how about you take a massive chill pill and we find it first? Yes, 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 yes! I'm just getting excited. And as crazy as Aiden's been lately, if he gets that thing, it would be bad. Well, if we beat him to it, he won't be able to get his slimy little hands on the thing. I'm starting to think that maybe we should try and keep a low profile while we look for the inn. These people seem pretty suspicious of us. Agreed. Hello! It is nice to meet Boy, you! Boy, these are some popular crafting tables. Don't worry, everyone. Your turn will come in time. Please have your materials ready when you approach the crafting table. Huh? I knew I shouldn't have waited so long to eat.
Hey there. Are you on the schedule for the furnace this afternoon? Didn't think there were any more appointments today. Hang on. Let me see here. Dale, 10 stone blocks. Oh, yes, that went very well. Uh, no appointment for me, thanks. I'm actually looking for the inn. Milo's place, right? It's back there. Right, Milo, thanks. How's it going, Lucas? I'm okay. Just watching these guards. They really mean business. Yeah, I wouldn't mess with them if I were you. And where should I put them? Yes, just get them here. I'll deal with them. Get out of here. Go, go! Uh, why, hello there. What can I do for you? I'm not sure what the custom is where you come from, but uh, here, <laughs> it is considered impolite to stare. I heard from someone in town that you could help me. Other people were talking about me? <laughs> they must have me mistaken with some other handsome innkeeper. <laughs> <clears throat> Out of curiosity, what is it that uh, they thought I could help you with? I'm sorry, but I'm actually quite busy. Inns don't keep themselves, you know. Lots of busy work. Some punks are trying to steal the Eversource. You know anything about it? Really? You come up to me interrogating me about some outlandish nonsense, and then you want to discuss someone stealing our city's most valuable treasure? I don't want any part of it. I'm sorry, but it's like I told those other outsiders. I can't help you. Now, please. Hey, this is our guy? He tell you where to find the blaze rods? How many of you are there? I told you, I don't know anything. He hasn't told you anything yet? Is he hiding them somewhere? Come on, you can trust me. Nothing bad is gonna happen, just help us. Fine, if it will make you leave me alone. That Aiden fellow did come talk to me early. Wanted to know where the Eversource was. Called it! I just told him what everyone else already knows. The Eversource is in the palace with the founder. That's all that happened, I swear. What a bunch of creeps. Yes, I wasn't terribly fond of them. So where is Aiden now? The group left for the palace, and I haven't seen them since. Attention! Attention, everyone! Just a moment of your time, please. Emergency meeting attendance is mandatory. Oh, slime blocks. Curious. I wonder what that's all about. It's the founder! I wonder what this is all about. Yes, I'm nervous being surrounded by so many people. Guys, I think I found the blaze rods. Oh no. What are they doing? People of Sky City, I'm sorry to pull you from your duties, but something urgent has come to my attention. A crime has been committed. A crime? What kind please, of crime? Please, please remain calm. Earlier today, outsiders built a bridge into our fair city from a distant island. Now, whether these outsiders know it or not, this is a violation of Sky City's most sacred law. No unauthorized building. Wait, is that you? Are you the bridge builders? Obscene! Evil builders! Atrocious! Uh, no, what? Why would you even ask that? Jesse, wherever you are, step forward now. I have already been informed of your identity. I appreciate that you may be ignorant of our laws, but I will warn you, Sky City is small, and I promise that if you try to hide, I will find you. We need to get to that. 
resource at whatever cost. This is clearly our fastest way into the castle. By getting arrested? Wait! Don't be fooled by the Founder's lies. I can help you come up with a plan to get into the palace. Here I am! I built the bridge! <gasps> Are you crazy? Does she look like she's gonna help us? Hey! Uh, unhand me! Come with me! Sorry, I I'm going with Milo. Me too! Quick then, follow me! Wait, wait! I'm wait, coming hey, peacefully! That's them! They're getting away! After them! Jesse, run! Get up. Run! Get to them there! Come on! Just in here, yes. There's nowhere to hide in here. It's a dead end. Before I take you to any further, you must take an oath. I think they went this way. You must swear to never reveal what I'm about to show you. What? Do you swear that? You can't let him get away! Milo, I solemnly swear that I will never tell your secret to anyone else. Fantastic. Philippe? This way! This is Build Club. Whoa. Everything you see before you was built from resources that my people have saved or uh, obtained. Man, can't be easy to come by some of this stuff. Nice work. Wow, this is quite the secret hideout, Milo. Very nice. <clears throat> it is not a hideout. It is a build club. You see, one day, a long time ago, I was just a citizen of Sky City, like any other. I wanted to make a community garden, so I put in a petition for a dirt block, and mercy me, it was granted. But in my excitement and haste to build my garden, I accidentally dropped my new block, and it fell right over the edge. For my crime, I was tossed into the Founder's dungeons. And I was in there for a very, very long time. Oh, how I grew to hate that dungeon. Well, okay, but it was an accident. They can't lock you up for that, can they? Oh, but they can. It was deemed an egregious wasting of resources. You see, in our world, when something falls over the edge, it is gone, forever. But I have always believed in my heart that just because building is risky, it doesn't mean that no one should do it. If only I had known you were builders sooner, I would have helped you all escape when I first met you, rather than let your friends be taken. But at least you are here, yes? I would like to save Lucas, and Ivor, I guess. Milo, our friends are in trouble. We have to help them. Yes, I know, hey, I... Hey, Milo! Ah, hello, my friends. Bringing in outsiders? Seriously? Pretty hard to keep this a secret club if you just bring people in. Yeah, we have it hard enough as it is. Everyone, please! Hey, guys, don't worry. We're builders just like you. Yeah, Jesse's right. Just chill out. We're the ones that built that bridge into town today. What? Dude! Milo, jeez! Milo, are you kidding me? The most wanted criminals in the whole city? We gotta turn him in before the guards break our door down. Well, no, let's not do that. I assure you, harboring them is worth the risk. They are the epitome of Build Club material. Builders, I'm not sure. Say they're builders. Oh, perhaps a challenge? All right, then. If Milo says you're these amazing builders, prove it. Yeah, build something. Now, see here, this is all highly disrespectful to my guests. I'm the leader here. I think I know my way around a crafting table better than any of you chumps. Oh, cocky. Let's see if you can back that up. We don't know many recipes, so if you just show us something that they build where you come from. You're 
gonna be just fine, Jesse. Jesse, it took us many weeks to scrape together this inventory. Please, use them for your build. Yeah. Oh, thanks. Now, what do you think the... Let's see here. Anyone got something to take notes with? No. Darn. I guess I'll just have to try to remember all this then. Meth? Getting nervous yet, Milo? <laughs> what? No, of course not. Well, this day is going exactly as I hoped it would go when I got out of bed this morning. Nope. <laughs> <gasps> Mercy! Uh, uh... Jesse, what is that thing? Is it... is... is it safe? Fear not, everyone. The golem is under my control and obeys my every whim. I am so sorry we ever doubted you. Your building is truly magnificent. We all bow to you. I can understand why the guards are after you. I mean, that was awesome. Right? I told you. Yeah, we're really sorry. Wowzers. So sorry. <sighs> yeah. Sorry. We're sorry. Uh, I'm sorry. Hey, these things happen. Apologies totally accepted, dudes. Now, uh, how about that whole getting us into the palace thing? Yeah, that would be great. Ah, yes, of course, of course. That is, after all, why you are here. I must say, though, after seeing you in action, your skills are even more impressive than I could have imagined. So impressive that I wonder if I could implore you for a tiny favor. What kind of favor? I help you get into the palace. You help me steal the Eversource for my people. Unlimited resources for everyone! I'm overwhelmed at the thought. Okay, but my friends are in trouble in there. So for breaking into the palace, we're going to save them. This is an acceptable and noble arrangement. Good. Now, as for how to get into the palace, according to my informants, the founder keeps the Eversource behind a secret door located in her throne room. Dramatic. Every night, the Founder leaves guards at every door, but there's a single window at the back of the palace that is left unguarded. It's an almost perfect point of entry, but it is far too high. <laughs> if we can find a way through that window, the Eversource would be practically within our grasp. Guys, how high it is doesn't matter. What? You just have to start thinking like real builders and craft a solution. Yeah, like a ladder. Building ladders? Craft a way in? If you could show us how to craft something that would reach the window, we could get this heist underway. Jesse, we will never forget this day. Okay, my friends, this should take us right into the throne room. Once inside, we will just need to find the secret entrance that the Founder supposedly uses. Isn't it exciting? On our way to changing everything! Freeing the Eversource for the people! Hey, would you keep it down, Milo? We're sneaking in, remember? Sneaking. Right, right, right. My apologies. I'm just so excited. Actually, out in the field, applying ladders to a wall. Okay, let's 
throne room was in here. Yeah, I know. I know. Why are you saying things to me that I already... Whoa! Whoa. Jesse! Jesse! Petra! Boy, am I glad to see you guys. Right back at ya. Hang on, I thought you guys were arrested. We were! But we broke out. No thanks to you! Ivor, easy. It's a good thing you guys are here. Aiden's going after the Eversource. Which we obviously can't abide! We're here to get it first! Fantastic! That is what we are doing as well! Who, uh, who's this guy, by the way? I mean, I assume he's cool, right? Oh, right. Milo Lucas. Lucas? Milo. Milo Ivor? Ivor Milo. He's a new friend. I am charmed. Yeah, yeah. The Founder's secret entrance is supposed to be somewhere in this throne room. If it's in here, we'll find it. I'm getting a very door vibe from this. Yeah. What happened to it? Just need to make something to activate that redstone circuit again. There's gotta be something in here we can use. Like a lever. If you can find one of those bad boys, we'll have that secret door open in a snap! How's it looking? Still looking like it needs power. Don't worry, I'll find the answer. Okay. I believe in you. Habits of the Enderman by Soren? Wow, well, how'd that get here? I mean. Hmm, I get the feeling this is a special tree. Yes, the ground you're standing on is actually the original island that all of Sky City started from. That tree dropped the saplings that grew into every tree on the island. I may not agree with the Founder's methods, but even I must admit, that's an impressive feat. Well, that is pretty special. Lava and water, placed exactly far enough that when they collide, it creates cobblestone! Genius! Jesse? What are you doing? Ha, <laughs> sorry. See anyone? Not yet, but the acoustics are funky in this place, so it's hard to tell when people are coming. We shouldn't hang around. Got it. This would be the perfect spot for it. Poor dead bush. Barely more than a bundle of sticks. 
Hopefully no one will miss one dead bush. Perfect. That is ingenious. Yeah, and it should be just the thing to make a lever with that stick I found. Okay, let's do this. Ah, my old friend the lever. Fantastic! Yeah. Didn't know you were watching. My apologies. It is still just such a thrill to see someone so confident and sure in their building abilities. Here we come. <sighs> wow, look at all these chests. Yeah, and they're all... Creeper, zombie, sheep, pigman. Curious. But what does it mean? Huh. Eggs? The sign says sheep, not eggs. Might as well throw it and give it a shot? A sheep? Is... is that a monster? That's not so bad. It is fluffy. The eggs all have creatures inside them. And they're all different colors. They must be, you know, color-coded what's in them. So, she can just spawn things whenever she wants to. So this must be where the resources come from. Different monsters and creatures, different drops. Stay on your toes! We're close! Ah! I can't wait! Let's take a look around. Source. What? No way. Yes, the spawn eggs. It's so simple. So the chicken lays the eggs, and the eggs make the monsters, and the loot from the monsters made this place. We'll throw it in the minecart and let's get out of here. We're still taking it, right? The chicken that the entire city depends on? Are you sure that's a good idea? What are you talking about? We need to bring it to the people. With it, we'll finally be free of the Founder! But that clucking thing is what we came for! Milo's right. The Eversource belongs to the people. What? I thought that was the whole point of this adventure! I knew it! I knew you were here to steal from me! She's too fast. Just Take it, you're... Says the trespassing criminal. It's just like I told you, Founder. They're here to steal the Eversource. Classic Order of the Stone. You don't say. What? No! Don't believe them! You have the wrong idea! Oh, Aiden, will you just shut up already? 
You just expect me to believe a bunch of criminals? Aiden warned me that you were a pack of thieves, and here you are, prepared to make off with the one thing our city depends on to survive. Boy, when you put it like that, I almost feel bad. Yep, afraid I'm going to be taking the chicken. It's mine now. What? This is outrageous. Aiden, don't do this. Somebody order eggs. Reaper, look out! See? Holy crap, you're down here too? Lucas, you made it! Oh, yeah, only slightly worse for wear. Ah, gotta say, Aiden's tougher than I remember. Mm, got me pretty good. I'm just so glad you're okay. When Aiden pitched you over the side, that was awful. Yeah, I wasn't a huge fan either. <laughs> that was good of you to try and save the founder. Uh, speaking of whom, is she okay? She's just sort of staring. Uh, let me ask. Founder? Miss Founder? I, uh, hope she's not in shock or something. We made it! We're alive! This is huge! Yes. Yes, you are correct. This... this is huge. <sighs> mm. This has been down here the whole time. I forbade anyone to look for land below us. It was too dangerous. A, a lost cause. Well, land is gonna be a pretty big game changer for you guys. I mean, it's gonna change everything. Yes. Look at this place. Totally untouched biomes all around us. Yes, it's all a little overwhelming. What, what do I do now? Well, how about you start with a few deep breaths? <laughs> First things first, we're gonna go back up there and kick Aiden's butt. Sounds like the start of a winning plan to me. Getting back up? My word, you're right. We need to do that. I hadn't even thought that far ahead yet. Oh, that 
That's not a good sign. Definitely a bad sign. Your city's probably in big trouble right now. I can't believe it could be so stupid. I can't leave my subjects in whatever trouble they're in. Jesse, will you please help me get back to Sky City? Stop Aiden. Help me protect my people. We did kind of start this mess. Of course I'll help you. You're the founder. Thank you, Jesse. And please, call me Issa. Okay, getting back up. Getting back up. Let's see what we've got to work with. Hmm, that'll work. What is it? Ah, oh, I see where you're getting at. Nice. Get ready to build the tallest thing you ever built. What? We're gonna build a tower of dirt all the way back up to Sky City. Grab as much dirt as you can carry. Oh, okay. That should do it. Jesse, what is that? Uh, what? What is it? Just once I get my flint and steel back from the blaze rods, it'll be my ticket out of here. Well, guys, you ready? Yes, I, I think so. I, uh... I actually gotta sit this one out, Jesse. Aiden got me pretty good. I'm just not sure I'm up for towering all the way back up there. I'm really sorry. I probably wouldn't be able to keep up anyway. Sit back, Lucas. Jesse's on the case. <laughs> I knew you could handle it. There you go, buddy. Thank you for trying to help. It was very noble. Hey, what's with the last goodbye tone? I'll see you guys when you get back. Oh, give Aiden another punch for me. Will do. Come on, we've got an epic climb ahead of us. We've got a city to save. You ready? I believe so. And when I get up there, I'm going to tear those blaze rods limb from limb. Oh, I'm Jesse. I appreciate what you did up there. Trying to save me, I mean. is under attack by monsters, ma'am. Everywhere. They seem to be coming from inside the palace itself. Come on, we need to stop him. I'm sorry, Jesse, but I have to save my people. Take care of yourself out there, okay? And to you as well. Jesse, you're alive. Please, can you help us? Hang tight, Milo. Very 
quick on your feet. But with all seriousness, how are you alive? I saw you go over the edge. Hey, quick version. You know how you all thought there was nothing but void below you? Yes. Yeah, that was wrong. There's land. You speak truthfully, my friend? <laughs> well, I can't wait to hear all about it later. I gotta get to the palace. Thank you, my friend. We'll see you on the other side. Stand to see someone else in the spotlight, can you? You just can't let anyone else win. Oh, it just drives you crazy to see someone else succeed, doesn't it? Aiden, this isn't about who wins and who loses, it's about what's right. And that is why you're gonna lose!
wait, wait, hang on, hang on. I, I, I surrender, I surrender. We can talk about this, right? Here, here, you want your flint and steel back, huh? Take it, it's yours. Just, please, don't hurt me. You did it. Jesse, we need to get out of here. What do you want to do with him? Please! This place is getting worse by the minute! You can't just leave me here! Take me with you! After everything you've done, I'm not sure you deserve that kind of mercy. No, 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 no! Come on! You can't just leave me behind! If you leave me here, I'll die! Thank you enough. You've saved us all. So what do we do now? Everything's just so different and scary. Just take it slow, okay? You guys have been isolated for so long, you, you don't want to get overwhelmed by all this real world. Uh, uh, <sighs> I wonder what happened to Aiden. Hey, cards. Check out what washed up right next to me. Uh... Freeze, criminals! You're not going anywhere! Now, this is just speculation, but I'm guessing they have some regrets. I knew they wouldn't get away. Ooh, I bet the blaze rods are in for a bad time. 
These Sky City people are not happy with them. Yeah. Hopefully they dig a deep hole, bury them in it, surround it with lava, and... Sorry. Got a little carried away there. Attention! Attention! Hello, hello, everyone, please. This is your founder speaking. Now that we're all safe, we need to organize. Start planning our new community. Are you listening to yourself? That's insane! We were prisoners long enough on that island in the sky. It is time for us to run free, build whatever we please. Wow, those two just cannot get along. Jesse, I cannot allow my people to be influenced by this naive idealist. Bah! I'm sure I do look like a naive idealist through the eyes of an oppressive dictator. What? Hey, both of you, fighting isn't going to solve anything. It will if I win. Oh, of course you'd think that way. No, you don't understand. It will be night soon, and that is when the monsters come out. If we don't prepare, we'll be in danger. You're just making excuses to control our behavior, just like before. We must trust in ourselves, be able to learn from our mistakes. The people need to build! W what do we do? Who are we supposed to listen to? Of course the people can build, but we need a system, some rules. Rules aren't bad. Well, I think you're both right. You don't want to just run around with no plan, but you can't schedule and organize everything either. People need to be free to try new things, but you've got to be safe about it. I suppose I still have much to learn. Thank you, Jesse. I don't understand yet, but I trust you. Well, Jesse, I suppose the era of Sky City is over. We may disagree about how to run this place, but I thank you for everything you have done. I guarantee that we will be telling stories about your visit for many, many years to come. The day that Sky City was liberated. A hero of few words. I can respect this. You know something? She was a little scary at first, but... She's alright. <laughs> I'm gonna miss that crazy guy. I guess we should prepare for Nightfall too. Without another portal, we're stuck here. Been a while since I've had to start from square one. Ugh. Just when I thought my days of punching trees were behind me. Oh, that's right. In the middle of all the fighting and everything, I almost forgot. When I was on the ground with the Founder before I totally found the portal. And you didn't say anything? Yeah. I'm actually gonna have to agree with Ivor on this one. Did I not mention it either? Cause I could have sworn I said something. No, you didn't. I guess the moment just never presented itself. Come on. Oh, hi. Ah, oh, there you are. I'm so sorry about her. That's okay. Looks like she's having fun running around. Yes, I think she took it pretty well when I told her she didn't need to be the Eversource anymore. What are we going to do with you now, huh? What are you going to do now? Besides, continue to be adorable, of course. <laughs> but that was a given. You're not going to eat her, are you? Don't be morbid. Of course not. After so long being the Founder and the Eversource, now we can just be Isa and her best friend, Benedict. Ah, uh, that's a boy's name. Huh, what a closed-minded attitude. Jesse, I would be honored if you would take this as a small token of our gratitude. Thank you. Come along, Benedict. We have a lot of adventures ahead of us. Well, there goes the Eversource. Off to cluck and peck at seeds for the rest of its valuable life. Hey, Jesse. You okay? Jesse? Yeah, I'm fine. Come on, let's head home. See? Just like I told you, one portal back home. I just can't wait to put this whole world behind us. Oh, is someone being grumpy? No, a little. I was just hoping for a real treasure is all. <laughs> oh, Livestock's no proper treasure. 
Although I wonder what would happen if you put that tiny crown on a different chicken. Come on, guys. Let's go home. We don't Axel and Olivia here where we've been. They'll never believe it. it. That's not what I was expecting.